Hello, my friends, and welcome back to the Grim Darkness 40k. Um, so the previous episode, we learned that uh, Flamer Imperial Guard are even worse than Space Marine Imperial uh, Flamer troops. Uh, they're just too fragile. Their attack has severe limitations on what it can damage. It's kind of like a weird area of effect. Admittedly, the 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 Flamer vehicle, not a Chimera, but similar frame. I keep forgetting what the hell it's called. I'll find out in a minute. Um, that's pretty good because it has like because it's a vehicle, it can get where it needs to be to actually direct its flame, and it's relatively tough. All right, it's an engagement. It's just a straight up fight in not particularly good terrain for us. Huh, an armored sentinel. Interesting. So there's the Chimera, which is the transport. And it looks to me like I don't actually have the Flamer transport available you know these flamer teams just have no chance of uh, getting into a position where they would be dangerous and they've got no reaction fire I suppose at least with frag grenades they can do a little something Now, the one thing is, you might as well deploy all the infantry, because it just costs nothing. The Lasgun troopers are actually pretty decent. The Grenaders even more so. Now, Plasma Gun Guardsmen are good stuff. And it looks like I have a pick for four here. They're fragile, but they're powerful. I actually genuinely don't have many force points to play around with here. So maybe on this occasion we'll skip them. This is my uh, Chimera with double reaction. Armored Sentinel. Maybe this is an opportunity to try and level up the Armored Sentinel. So, some of these boys have got some EXP. Let's go with the ones that don't. I'm going to try and broadly level up my dudes because we know that in the future there'll be missions where we deploy the vast majority of our units let's take out the one with the most experience let's include a Ogryn team once again just picking one with very little EXP okay let's go No idea if I'm going first or they're going first. Fifteen turns. It's a lot of turns. This messy terrain is going to benefit the orcs a lot more than me. Man, so few points on such a big map. I 
I'm glad it's at cheap units because there's really not there's not a whole lot here to use to cover such a wide amount of terrain. Well, let's hope that the green skins have not got too much more than me. Well, their turn was pretty quick. So maybe that's a good sign. Let's go, guardsmen. I'm actually quite nervous. These units are very fragile. Normally I would lead with something heavy, but I don't really have a lot of heavy options. Alright, looks like this middle area is clear. Clear-ish. Okay, I've got some cover here that I can use. Waddle, waddle, waddle. have movement but I don't find I don't see the enemy these uh, this terrain is gonna make it extremely difficult for them to maneuver they can only maneuver here here and this wide area here which if I were them that's where I would be Shot from there. Waddle, waddle, waddle. I do have a shot. It's not great damage, but it will do. Plasma guns. Okay, we've got some firepower here. Let's see. Range 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I should have a shot. But I don't. Guess it counts as 7. Smoke out. What happened? Well, I guess the grenade went off or it went dud, I don't know. No idea, that's weird.
You two can just sit here and block this passage, and if they're going around this way, you'll be able to see them as well. This is definitely going to represent a lot of their points. And it's full of dudes. So these boys should only have one move, because they've deployed. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Oh, the Guardsmen's grenade launchers are going to have a field day with you. Steal her in! Steal her in! <laughs> We will call this operation the Stealer In. Crack the boy. Oh, come on. That was awful. Stealer In. We have deployed numerous beacons. Have another crack grenade. All right, that one did a little bit more. Steer in. <laughs> oh, if you haven't played the original Dawn of War, you really should just for that. But you'll have to play an old version because I think they they wrote him out. They uh, they changed the voice actor. He sounded so terrible. <laughs> he was brilliant. <laughs> All right, I have a shot on these uh, sluggers, but I'm going to save it for now. Forty percent chance to hit, but that's because there's a fifty percent chance to hit the vehicle in front. Ooh, more grenade launchers. Out of range, I'm gonna have to take a reaction shot here. Uh war buggy, twin linked shooter, okay, it's fine. Ooh. God damn it, he managed to focus fire one. Oh well, whatever. Steal rain. Nice kill. Just change the angle slightly so I can see what I'm doing. Damage potential very high. Not a great chance to hit though. Okay, so their morale is broken and their morale is broken. Due to the wreck, I haven't got a really great chance to hit. I do not want to take a reaction shot from flash gits. It's That will hurt. Uh, it will hurt a lot. I could las gun them. Let's do it. Nice. All right, the Armored Sentinel can take it. It's a reasonably tough beast. Oh, that really hurt though. Did 
This is better have been worth it. Eat plasma. Ooh, nice. Sweet. What do we got? Alright, that's not very exciting. So we have a med pack that's not usually that that's not that great, and then we have body armor. <laughs> For our incredibly fragile boys who currently have 3010. I wonder how much it increases my ballistic protection by. It hasn't actually said anywhere. That's the wrong unit. I wish this game was more clear about what the upgrades did. Right, now even though these boys' morale is broken, I still want to hurt them. Just in case the orcs use the old mighty wah to repair them. Nice kill. Oh man, that was a big fat fail. Alright, that leaves my las gunners. Might as well take this shot now. Okay, not the best shot ever, but there's only three dudes here and two of them can't move forward, so... Hopefully reaction fire will deal with this mess. Meanwhile, my two guardsmen here can just sit and uh, watch the flanks. Oh, nasty. Fire incoming. Fire incoming? You mean big steel axes incoming? Guardsman. So fragile. Forty five percent. It's not a great chance to hit. Got a shot. Forty five. Got a shot. Fifty. Not bad. That's not good. <laughs> nice work. Grenade launchers. Should I take this shot? I'm risking hitting my own guys. Uh, hopefully I won't need to, let's see. Okay, I kind of need to. Oh, I can bust the wall with a grenade launcher. Nope, not very powerful. Well, it looks to me like we've got some more boys up there.
I didn't use my sentinel, did I? That was dumb of me. Sentinel's found. Firing main weapon. Come on. You know, for a weapon with a hundred power and a hundred piercing, we are really getting some desperately low rolls here. When the las guns are doing more damage than the friggin, uh, sorry, when the, uh, the laser pointers, the las guns are doing, uh, yeah, that's what I said. They're doing more damage than the las cannon. It's when you know the dice are against you. Right, you two head up this way. We have points to capture. Hopefully the armored sentinel can just take this transport down. Guardsmen are soft. Come on. Yes! We've finally got a good hit. Oh, followed by a diabolical one. If he goes this way, I should be able to intercept him, hopefully. Get him! Get the knobs. They are the threat. I don't even know why I bother with these grenades, they just don't work. <laughs> okay, that was a, a misaimed shot there, but whatever. This tight area is just death to guardsmen. I can't go in there with with zerglings. They will just be killed. Ooh, nice kill. Khan Ogren. Oh, nice. <laughs> He is indeed running away. Come on. Nice hit. Finally. What an absolute pain in the ass that was to kill.
Yeah, that's a really bad idea. Alright, this unit is leveled up, so I actually don't want to use it. Nice work. Nice work, boys. Looks like we got a small team of orcs up there. Out of range, out of range. Nice. Okay, it's a little bit of damage. Do you know what? There's probably not much up here, so let's move. I'm thinking we found it all so far. Ooh, nice hit. And a beautiful kill for the Ogren. Poor Godsman. So fragile. But their fragility is not like the biggest deal. When you get so many of them. Ah, reaction fire. Herder. Grot herder, runt herder, pain in the ass herder. I don't know why it's not showing me whose reaction fire is in here. Shooters. Okay, it's them. Uh, this is also reaction threat shooters. Okay, fine, whatever. I'm going to have to take it. Nice. Nice. Finish them. Fatality. All oh, right, and the smaller boys have wet themselves. Perfect. God damn tacticals. Ah! We're hits. Nice. We're hits. Nice. <laughs> Gretchen are so bad they can't even hurt these guardsmen. I say that, and then they get some hurting.
Jesus! Two crits! Nasty! What have you got a shot on? Ugh. Thirty percent. Do it. No shot yet. Nice. Come on. Man, those boys are in trouble. There's only six turns left, though. I should have taken some heavier gear. Oh well. Fire incoming. <laughs> well, they got the point. <laughs> Jesus, 64 damage plus 35 from Gretchen. These guardsmen are useless. And the smoke grenades don't work. Which is very helpful. Nice shot. Well, I just need to survive. Ooh, nice hit. <laughs> Two Gretchen still managed to get a kill. 
Aren't these the guys with the armor? No, these are not the guys with the armor. Okay. Zeno's found. Firing main weapon. Well, oh, that was a mistake. Oh, well, I got plenty of movement. I can just do it. Go back. Oh, nice. This kind of tight, close-in map really favors the orcs over the uh, Imperial Guard. But I really needed to just take some more Ogrins, stuff that could actually handle a bit of a bit of damage. Where is he? There he is. How about you die? Oh god, he summoned another set. Nice. <laughs> Ornate is, is functional. The Emperor approves. Relic plating. Increases heavy armor. Reveals the map and gives an accuracy bonus to hit all enemy units within 12 tiles. Wow, that's amazing. Yes, please. That's going to allow me to actually see into the fog of war and prevent myself from being ambushed by the Orcish Menace. Two turns to go, and I already have most of the VPs, and I don't think they're going to get them back, so we are good to go. Nice. How dare you. Run away. Stay alive, guardsmen. Your duty is not yet complete. God, this guy is tough. <laughs> Aww. There's no problem we can't solve with wave after wave of our own men. <laughs> 
Well, I probably shouldn't have taken a load of units that I knew were bad. Those two boys that were guarding that passageway, I should never have pushed them up. I should have moved them across to support. But, uh... I just didn't really have a lot of units to work with. And basically the main problem is, I didn't have, apart from one set of Ogren and the Sentinel, I didn't really have anything tough to lead the way. Um, and also, just some really terrible RNG on the Sentinel versus the uh, the War Truck. The War Truck got way more kills than it ever should have, because uh, we did like 7 and 10 damage to, the, uh, to it with the Sentinel, which was not so great. Because, in theory, a Laz Cannon should eat War Truck for breakfast. But it, uh, it just didn't happen, so... Oh well. Assault. Ugh, I'm not looking forward to an assault. Guardsmen are not good at assaulting things, but... As we know, the skirmishes are very RNG, so maybe we get a nice, big, open map. We can really uh, take advantage of the Guardsman's massed firepower. Who knows, but if you want to know, then you're going to have to tune in next time.